Hey guys, I'm Vignesh and welcome back to my YouTube channel Cloud and AI Analytics. Hope everyone are doing good. So in today's video, we are going to see a small demo uh, labs on uh, Cloud PubSub using Cloud Functions. In my previous video, I have explained you what is Cloud Function, when to use Cloud Function and did a small lab on how to configure Cloud Function uh, with Cloud Storage and basically we, we did uh, configure like when a file is uploaded to Cloud Storage then we have to trigger that cloud function so if people who didn't see that video i'll give that link of that particular video in the description box please take a look at it so coming back to this video we will be directly jumping into the lab on how to configure cloud pubs up with cloud functions and the demo will be on that it is a very small and short video uh, and without any further delay let's get started so to do that, I'll go jump into my Google Cloud Console. So this is my Google Cloud Console. I'm into this first project. You can navigate to Cloud Functions from here or else you can just type it here also, Cloud Functions. So click on this Cloud Functions. Uh, for this demo, I'll be using this uh, specific uh, uh, function hyphen PubSub. I'll show you how to create this function, how to configure Cloud PubSub with Google Cloud Functions. So the environment, let it be first generation and um, uh, function name let it be pubsub iphone one and region let it be us central in, in under this you have to the trigger uh, you have to select cloud pubsub and you have to create a topic like for this demo i'll be using this function iphone demo uh, if you wanted to create a topic just click on this and give any name like this and it will take around less than a minute to uh, create this topic and later you can just save this so the runtime build connections and security settings i have already deployed i have already explained in the previous video please take a look at it and in the code level we'll be using same python 3.7 and the same inline editor which is uh, given by google cloud itself uh, in my next video i'll be explaining you with uh, custom code and how to import code from like a uh, zip file from cloud storage and from source repository i'll be explaining you in the upcoming videos for now, we will just go with the uh, actual uh, code itself, then click on this deploy. So if you want to uh, go to the next tab, you can go here or just click on this deploy. It will take around two to three minutes to create this instance. So after this, this is the instance which we'll be using here. Uh, this is the instance which we'll be using for the demo, the same metrics, details, source variables, triggers, permissions, logs, everything will be here on testing uh, under this topic. Uh, go to like open this Google Cloud console and search for PubSub or again you can navigate it from here. Uh, PubSub it will be under uh, analytics. So under analytics you can give search for PubSub. So this is the demo which we'll be using for this. Uh, this is the function siphon demo we'll be using for this demo as well. And just you if you wanted to configure your you can add cloud functions here as well or if you wanted to import like basically we will be seeing uh, what is cloud pubsub and we will be exploring a lot about cloud, cloud pubsub in the upcoming videos as well i'll make videos on that as well for now just click on this messages and publish message so just add message this is my first and so on with cloud pubsub so just click on this publish message and you will get an, uh, a message saying that message has been published and now if you go to cloud functions uh, again come to logs basically uh, you can use this function to get triggered like you can uh, refresh as well so now if you see this is my first hands on with cloud pubsub so and then you can even pass uh, uh, that message no even you can pass json message as well so basically you can give name any name and uh, designation data analyst and uh, close the parenthesis and then publish like you uh, it can publish the same as well here so just refresh here and it is not refreshing just refreshing the function details refreshed okay we'll go we'll go to permissions again we'll come to logs so if you see our message has got a like name whatever the name which we have given or key and designation is data analyst 
so this is the uh, json message and this is the string message so that's it for this video um, i hope you learned something from this video how to configure cloud pub sub with cloud functions i'll use more uh, uh, custom functions and custom uh, custom code in our next upcoming videos as well so that you can get the exposure of what is happening in the real time as well so that's it for today's video if you have any questions or any doubts please post that in the comment section i'll take a look at it and reply it reply to it as soon as possible please uh, like uh, 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 comment and share share it with your friends and subscribe to cloud and AI analytics um, and i'll see you in the next video with more interesting content until then it's bye from viknesh happy learning